Hello everybody and welcome back to Tales of Zestiria. We have just left Gramps' domain. And we are on our way to find Alicia to warn her that she's being targeted by some crazy fox vampire hellion. Oh, I definitely feel like there's going to be so much stuff in this overworld that I miss. That's exactly why I want Mikleo to be using treasure detection instead of, uh, was it snack preparation? Snakes, watch for the pauses between attacks. It's amazing how they can move without arms and legs. Okay. Snake hellion snakes don't usually grow this big, so it's pretty obvious this is a hellion. Yeah. Okay, so this is what the stat page looks like. Down. The right bumper to confirm your target. While doing this, you can also switch targets using the left stick. Tapping right button will automatically switch targets to the enemy nearest you. Ready? Can't believe we'd run into a hellion all of a sudden. What luck! Quite strange. I hope it's just a coincidence. Yeah, definitely a coincidence, for sure. Strategy menu to direct your allies. Action, basic instructions such as which enemy to target. Tactics with balance to strike between close range and long range. Up in the character to attack. And a threshold for prioritizing recovery and defense instructions. Could it be I'm attracting them because they know I can see them? Who can say? It's too early to tell. Wait, that's... Hey, signpost. Central Lake Haven Heights, Lookout Rock. East to Lady Lake, west to Aroundite Forest. Watch your step on the Lookout Rock. What's that? Natural Lookout Point. Check out that view! Even the air seems different somehow. Definitely a change from Gramps' blessed domain. Alicia said the world below is full of malevolence. Can you feel it at all? I don't get that impression, personally. Me neither. I mean, it's so pastoral. Well, don't judge a book by its cover, as they say. But for now, at least we get a nice view. It's your first time here too, isn't it? What do you say? Are you pumped? Pumped? Well, mildly inflated, at least. <laughs> oh, it's all dry and I've got goosebumps, Mikleo. So this is the land below. What sights and sounds, it's something, all right. Uh, okay, north a bit. Look, there's the lake. And there's a huge city. Let's go check it out. Point of interest. Doesn't that normally come with a skip? Or not every time. In arts can overpower an enemy's martial arts. So when an enemy comes after you with a series of troubles from martial arts, by countering with your own series of hidden arts. On the other hand, hidden arts take more time to cast and consume more RC. 
fully master them, you need to consider when and how to best utilize them, whether in combos or other situations. Fair. Hey, look, more big rock. I ain't going that way. <laughs> now I really feel like I'm actually in another world. It's great to have a field trip and all, but try not to get us lost, please. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be just fine. I got us a map. Oh, you mean the one that's in the Celestial Record? It's kind of old, though. I'll probably need to redraw parts of it as we go along. Fair enough. Now, view the world map by pressing the right stick out of battle. From here, you can view map information such as which enemies appear in which area. semi-auto and auto. Yeah. Some kind of trouble? Looks like it. The cart stopped. I had the save point before interacting with this. Nope. Just, just barely nope. Hey, look, puppy. Okay, but now, save point. I not talked to... Saray, there's a dog here. Oh, hi, doggy. Aw, he's so cute. Is Mickey afraid of dogs? Ah. Hey, Mickleo, why don't you pet him? Animals like this one can sense us. It gives me the willies. <laughs> it's not funny. Everyone has things they're afraid of. That is fair. Looks like they're broken down or something. I need to talk to the humans in the bridge and see what's up. Yeah. Ooh. Hmm, I wonder which uh, particular human I should be talking to. How about you? I am Felis. The highlight of the Sacred Blade Festival is the Trial of the Sword. It's a recreation of the legendary shepherd withdrawing the sword from the stone. Are you sure there were regular old wolves? Are wolves prone to attack in broad daylight like that? Those wolves are pretty old coming to attack the caravan, eh? Guess they might have been seriously hungry. We're the Sparrow Feathers, a traveling caravan of merchants. I'm Agil, the captain. She's Rose. Nice to meet you. I'm Saray. Nice to meet you, too. You finally learned how not to be a creeper. <laughs> Shut it. Oh, hey, so if you're a traveling caravan, where are you traveling to? <laughs> We're going all over the world. Wow. 
We're protected by a free trade treaty, meaning we have a free pass to pretty much go anywhere we please. Sure, we get asked to smuggle all sorts of crap, but for us, trust is first and foremost. Dishonorable trade is fine for dishonorable people, but we do things our own way. And we're damn proud of it. This must be the famed capitalism of humans. Sure seems that way. Yeah. We're planning to stay in Lady Lake for a while. If you need anything, just give us a holler. Yeah. We will. Thanks. Though they really ought to focus on their cart before drumming up business. <laughs> Drop some stuff right here just so that nobody can walk by. Oh wow, that's some knife you got there. Think you could part with it for a thousand gold? Uh, no. It, technically, it isn't my knife, so I'd Aww, rather not. Too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. Oh wow, that's some knife. Aww. Let me know if you just that. I heard that Princess Alicia the came way forward when she got back to the capital. I would have loved to see the so called Princess Knight for myself. Princess Alicia, huh? Phew. Sounds like she made it back safe. Glad to hear that Fox Freak didn't catch up to her. But still, to think that she was royalty. No kidding. A straight up princess? A princess, a knight, and she explores ruins on the side? How'd she wind up with that gig? Won't know until we ask her. That's true. Besides, Foxy Loxy might be in town waiting for a chance to get at her. Yeah, we've gotta let her know. It's still working on the cart. Looks like the soldiers might be getting ready to let people in, maybe check with them. The entry paperwork? Sure, take care of it now, and I'll let you in just as soon as that cart's fixed. All right, I'll be right on it. Hmm. Hey, everyone. Sorry about the hassle. Well, that was well-timed. Welcome to Lady Lake. Finally, Aquapolis, here we come. Excited too, but don't make a scene. We don't want the humans kicking you out. Is like I can't believe it oh so this is how humans live don't they find it overwhelming wow gosh you'd think so just remember this isn't a sightseeing trip the real question is do we try to find Alicia first or look for the Fox man so let's have a look around town for now good call let's gather information Search around the capital for Alicia. Okay. It's a few different uh, markers to go for. Probably a hit all three to move on. It was like ages since the last time I had this much fun. It's been years since the last sword fest. That was a total blast. I told you, don't go off on your own. It's crowded in front of the sanctuary, and you'll end up getting lost. 
Come on, let's hurry up to the sanctuary. It's going to be over before I even got in there. Sword and the altar doesn't actually come out, believe me, I tried. Yeah, the goods still aren't here yet. The festival's about to start. Oh, hi there. Sorry to keep you waiting, but we're not quite ready to open yet. Do us a favor and come back a bit later, would you? I'll have to come back later. I'm waiting on delivery, then I'll have some stock to sell you. Fair enough. I... No, I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to the guy with the big backpack. And I guess I can't. Okay. They said the princess went missing, but I guess it wasn't true. My brother sure has his heart set on pulling out that blade. I guess it's a guy thing. The area in front of the sanctuary is absolutely packed with folks who want to try their luck at pulling out the sacred blade. I've heard there are pickpockets around, so I just you keep a hand on your purse. It's been a while since I've seen the capital so lively. Saray, look around you. Treasure around here? Ah. Amber waistcoat. Let's go down a bit. That's accuracy goes down a bit. Art defense goes. Oh yeah, okay. It says there. Art defense goes up. I was trying to guess based on the symbols there. In the bottom right. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Hey son, how about these duds? Made from real silk. My old lady will swap me for it, but they're yours for just 860 gold. Oh, is that cheap? Mm. Saray, behind him. Uh, should we give it what for? And have everyone think you're attacking the street vendor? You want to tour the inside of a human jail cell? To everyone else, he looks just like an ordinary human. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. part of the food stands at the plaza on the sword pulling contest. Didn't I tell you already your sister goes with you or you're not going to the festival at all? You don't want to lose your allowance for the week, do you? But mom, she's so slow. Tell her, would you? Understand now, child. No matter how tough things get, stealing is stealing. Shut up, old man. You smell like farts. <laughs> Great town.
I guess festival standards really dropped. I guess what that's what a bad harvest will bring you. Oh wait, wasn't there already Oh, I guess that kid ran off down there. Oh, let's follow up with that moving point of interest. Smell like you'd be mighty tasty. Hey, let's get out of here. Hmm. First, might as well wander the town a bit. Why'd they make it so big? We'll take ages to find our way around. I guess we'll have to deal with it, though, if we want to learn anything. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Invisible wall stopping me from interacting with the kid because he's actually a Hellion. Let's not get involved. Okay then. Anywhere else to look around here? Doesn't look like it. Remember, this place was in the Celestial Record. New discovery point, Great Sanctuary of the Sacred Blade. The sanctuary Blade. up ahead is supposed to house a sword protected by the Lady of the Lake. Wait, are you getting in line? No way. First, we've got to make sure Alicia's safe. I'm sure we'll be back. Whoa. No one told me the sanctuary would be this gorgeous. You can tell the shepherd myth is a big part of the culture here. Strange, though. There's no sense of blessing at all. Now that you mention it, we could always feel Gramps' blessing back in Elysia. Granted, Gramps is a particularly powerful seraph. But even so, this town has a high concentration of malevolence. It's honestly making me a little sick. You gonna be okay? For now, at least. I'm starting to think it'd be a bad idea to stay too long, though. This place has even more Hellions than we imagined. They're wandering around right there in front of us, and yet we can't do a thing. I'm as frustrated as you are, but our hands are tied. We don't have the power of purification. Besides, there's a reason for the Hellion manifestations. They're feeding on the evil in people's hearts. And in such a pretty town. Probably part and parcel of life in human cities. Oh, hey, look. Is that a monolith? The points. Yeah. It, TLDR, don't die. There must be herbs around here. Rosemary. Uh, okay. Where? Noble District? Yeah, you know what? Noble District, a princess knight, uh, is probably somewhere called the Noble District. It, that would make sense.
Saray, look carefully at the ground. Okay. The noble district looks super small. Find a couple people over here, and then something over there. Let it be known, I am dismayed at the Princess Knight's actions too. For someone of her standing, all this sneaking around is unbecoming. What on earth is Sparkler doing, sending the princess off on her own like that? I don't see a dog. Hey, okay, another person. All this simpering and smiling at royalty and frilly coat people is rather wearing me out. Guessing whatever dog we're talking about is through there, because... Can't see... I don't think there's anything in that corner. Oh, that dog. Right here. Oh, the gate's open. Oh, hello. He's here. No mistake, that's the fox man. After him. I guess the dog also had the same idea. So Alicia really is the fox man's target. Looks like it. He probably retreated for now because of the commotion. Um. This guy from before. Now I am the Kelvin Mason. Let's go after him. Yeah, okay, but where? I saw the dog ran out this way. I don't see anywhere it could have gone. Hey, did you see a dog run around? No one can enter the palace without express permission. Yeah, that's that, that's fine. You don't have anything new to say. That's still a dead end. Is this the direction I came from? Yes, yes it was. Um, make sure to get you a souvenir next time we meet. I'll be able to tell you all my exciting travel tales. Okay. Um.
Well, am I supposed to be able to figure out where... where they went? There might be something nearby. This chest is locked. I'd rather it wasn't. Hmm. Okay. I guess just, uh... Head back into the town proper. Who would have thought that he would be this fast? Oh. The dog's still chasing him. We can't let him get away. There's the dog. Slow down, pup. safe. Looks like he cornered it. Are you ready? Of course. Your chicken hunting days are over, Fox. So, you're really that eager to die, are you? Ready? Unknown. Just because you beat him once, don't let your guard down. He might not have given us all last time. No information. Well, we didn't give our all last time either. Boy, is he in for a shock. Actually, wait, we probably did, but we'll do it again. After all, we've got the powers of a water seraph on our side. Stronger than I remember. When we fought him back in Elysia, he must have been weakened by Gramps' blessing. I'll burn you to cinders! Take that! Well, we Make were winning out. until a cutscene. <laughs> oh, I'm going to enjoy this. A fitting end for worms who dare to wriggle at a god! I swear, I wasn't... Quiet. Who... Who are you? We won't warn you again. Be silent. 
Have you forgotten our code, Lunar? You're all out of second chances, understood? Go. The assassination order was a mistake. Princess Alicia will no longer be our target. You expect me to believe that? We have our honor. Stay. The princess's enemies are legion. For those who wish to remove her, assassination is but one option among many. You have bigger worries than who we are or what we do. I suggest you hurry to the pedestal where the sacred blade is kept. Why are you telling me this? Honor. So, I guess I should be thanking you for saving us. Hmm. <laughs> hey, are you alright? What? What in the world? Looks like we were saved by an assassin's guild. By a what? They were after Alicia by mistake or something. They took that fox guy away with them. But more than that, it looks like Alicia's not out of danger yet. Looks like? What's going on? Hey, I don't get it any more than you do. Let's just hurry to that pedestal. Oh, that's exciting. A blessing orb? So there's still someone after Alicia. I'm not totally sure what's going on here, but either way, we better get to the Lady of the Lake Sanctuary quick. Right. Blessing orb, no, which can't grants life force to all things, even Hellions, boosts everyone's max health depending on number. <laughs> Decorated with a dragon looking crest thing. Good description. Uh, okay, so. Two different. Points of interest towards the sanctuary. Well, this is the one we looked at last time. Let's head back to the front. I'm guessing we're not going to be able to get in through the front. Yeah, too big of a line still. We can't go any further. There's got to be some way. Hey, you know cutting in line, single file only. Now you want to line up, get to the back now. So we're pulling contests to take place after the ceremony. Until then, stand in line and wait. No one's allowed into the sanctuary until the ceremony is complete. We'll let you know when it's time. How are we going to get them to let us in there? We've got to come up with a way of getting inside the sanctuary. I'm guessing that means back down here, and there's some sneaky way in. It seems there's a treasure chest near us. Void ring. I think that would be useful for you. Elvin, effect of slow reduced by 50%. Sweet. Wait, that's... Thank you, treasure detection. I mean, I was gonna check back here anyways, because I saw on the map, it looked like a dead end, but still. It's the exact kind of time when it is very useful. No entry. If you want to check out the festival, go out front. What gives? 
You're letting him through. Well, that's because I'm festival staff. That's right. Authorized personnel only. Everyone else, move along. But it's urgent. Can't you do anything? Afraid not. Well, I wonder what the um, point of interest over there is. I've no time for this. You got authorization or not? Oh! I can't be bothered with you. Now scram. Yeah, fair enough. Do you need a hand? You look like you're in a bind. I bet you want to get at that pedestal now, don't you? Yes. Alicia could be... They don't need to know that. I mean, if you could help me out... It really make my day. Sure thing, but we'll need some cash. Cash? Yep. Remember the guard back there? He's not averse to a little grease on his palm, if you know what I mean. We can get you through. How much? Let's see. I think 1,000 gold ought to cover it. Hmm. Change your mind? Well, think it over. It's no skin off our butts either way. Do I have any money? No, I have no money. No money whatsoever. Okay. What are they going to say if it's... I don't have enough. Hmm. Well, got any valuables? Something worth money. Yeah, the, uh, the dagger. <laughs> uh, I can't really see us parting with a thousand gold for something like that. Yeah, neither can I. But... You know what? I think this would probably work. But... I know this will work. But she was offering a thousand gold for it earlier. You really okay with this? All right, this is worth a thousand gold and then some. Leave it to us. All right, let's go. Was this right? You only did what you had to do to warn her. Oh. That's fine. This is the guy. You good? All right, then. I'll be taking your sword. Let's have it. At least Mikleo is still fully armed. Well, that was easy. Well then, we gotta get back to work. Thanks so much. They don't care about her knives? No? No? Okay. Ooh, made it in. Finally, come on, let's start looking for Alicia. Huh. Hmm. We went through all that trouble, and we can't see the pedestal. Is that what you're thinking? <laughs> Well, sorta. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Being invisible has its benefits. Yep. Seriously? Ah, I think I see Alicia down there. Yeah, looks 
Skalisha's there. First, though. Oh, maybe not first. Oh, come on, dude. Hey, Saray, come over here. It's not. What is it? Saray? Alicia! Is that you, Saray? Welcome! And who may this be? This is Saray. Ah, yes, the one who rescued our princess way out there in the ruins. Saray, this is Lady Maltran. She's been appointed as the committee leader for the festival this year. She is also the one who taught me the way of the spear. Nice to meet you. I'm Saray. It is a pleasure. By any chance, did you come here to attempt the trial of the blade? Not just that. To tell you the truth. What this mysterious organization has told you is true. There are indeed those who think less than favorably of me. But even so, I cannot live my life in fear of them. But... but Alicia... Thank you so much, Saray. I really appreciate your concern. Soon, the finale of the festival, the Flames of Purification, will begin. Please enjoy yourselves. Hmm. So this is what states people deal with. She didn't even flinch. Oh, that's right. Check out the pedestal. Oh, right. What about this pedestal? Am I allowed to... No? Sorry, no, okay. Look around you. Yeah, I, I, dude, I'd love, I'd love to, but um, uh, that's fine. Look at the pedestal. Oh, just lady having a nap right in front of the pedestal. This, this seems fine. If no one else can see her, does that mean she's a seraph? You probably can't remove the sword unless you can speak with her, meaning no ordinary person can do it. Fair. Incredible! So that means the legends were true. Hey, say something to her. Me? Unless you want me looking like a total weirdo. But still... Ladies and gentlemen, my fellow citizens of Lady Lake, for the past several years, we have abstained from our beloved festival in light of the general state of the world. But this year, thanks to the grace and assistance of Our Lady Alicia, the Sacred Blade Festival can be held once more. We yet live in a time of crisis. Violent weather, geopolitical tensions, pestilence, famine, the list goes on. However, I believe that it is precisely times such as these that make our cultural traditions and celebrations all the more vital to maintain. Oh, wondrous Lady of the Lake, show us your power! Merciful Lady of the Lake, hear our plea. Cleanse us of our sins and woes with your flames of purification. Citizens of Lady Lake, this jubilant festival shall be as a prayer to the heavens that we may know peace and prosperity. Some prayer, all right. This prayer of yours gonna give us our jobs back? The council already seized the crops and weaponry trades for the state. They might as well declare war and get it over with. Hey, lady, you trying to kill us? 
This ain't nothing but the council giving itself a pat on the back. Well, we're not gonna stand for it. Find someone else to lick your boots. Silence! Do not disturb the festival. Enough! Ha! Serves you right. <laughs> this whole riot was a setup. Look at that guard! This must be the work of the Chancellor. I can't believe they'd involve the citizens they swore to protect in a power struggle. Are we really so corrupt? Alicia! Saray, get to safety! No! You mustn't give in to hostility! Such emotions will breed hellions! To a hell game. The evil in people's hearts gives rise to malevolence. And once it reaches a certain point. Lady of the Lake! Can't you do something? You have the power of purification, do you not? A spirit? And you can see me? That's not good. Nicleo, put those flames out! The black flames are part of the Hellion itself. The most I can do is manage the regular ones. Okay. That's a start. Saray, you really can see Seraphim, can't you? This isn't looking good. The Hellions are coming out of the woodwork. The power of purification is not my own. It is a power given to those who would draw the sacred blade and become my sword. Then I'll do it. What? Saray. To become my sword is to serve as a vessel for me to dwell in, and to assume the Shepherd's burden. Blessed with the power of purification and abilities beyond human ken, cursed to be scorned by others and wrought with despair. To protect this land from the Hellions means a constant stream of agonizing decisions. It is a lonely battle, the likes of which you can scarcely imagine. That's the burden of the Shepherd? And you want Saray to take all that on right here and now? It is not to be done lightly. May I ask you your name? Oh, of course. I am Lila. Lila. My dream is to investigate ancient ruins all over the world. I believe that the legends of the past hold knowledge about how humans and Seraphim might one day live in harmony together. I must find a way to make that happen. To bring humans and Seraphim together again, as it was in the days of yore. If purifying the Hellions will save both humans and Seraphim, then... then it's the best chance I'll ever have to make that dream a reality. Are you... really okay with this? Saray. That's why... I shall become the Shepherd! I offer myself to you as your vessel, and shall bear your burden! I've waited long for this moment. For one who is pure of heart and free of corruption, a shining vessel to whom my words will reach. Uh, uh. Now, Saray, take up the sword! You got it! You? Get back, Alicia. 
Hey! You'll be able to handle the Hellions, right? Yeah. Just take care of the rest of the flames. Hellion I fought as the shepherd with the power of the sacred blade in hand. I know I can do this. Ferocity is the cause of a person's Hellionization. They sometimes take the form of ambulatory beasts. With the power of purification, we should be able to quell it without having to take its life. I can take care of those slimes with my fire. Purify them with the shepherd's power. Come hither. And let's see. Alien ooze. I hope this wasn't once a human. Strong enough hate or malice can sometimes take nebulous form, invisible to humans, and wreak havoc. We can purify it and cause it to dissipate. Come here, Be gone! Go How's this? Yeah. Right. Here we go. Come here, then. Ready? Strike! It's over! Now then! It's over! Now then! Hang on! Strike! Hang on! It won't end here! What? No! Saray! Are... Are you really? Yep. I am the shepherd now. Calm yourselves at once! Chancellor Bartlow. Lady Alicia, we received word that there was a civil disturbance among the commoners. Indeed. However, it has already been quelled. By the appearance of the shepherd, The Shepherd, you say? Citizens of Lady Lake, I hereby announce that this year's Sacred Blade Festival has come to a close. You heard him! Clear out at once! Please don't hold up track! Keep moving! Milady, I should like to ask the cause of all this at a later time. Lady Maltran, your presence is also requested. The shepherd of all things. <coughs> <laughs> now then, it is time for me to return to my place within you. Uh, yeah, I am the vessel after all. Now that's a creepy sight. What the... <laughs> Saray? What's wrong? It's because I have entered his body. I'm afraid he'll have a high fever lasting about three full days. What? Why? Oof. Presumably the human body is reacting to the sudden presence of unknown powers inside of it. Those who make a pact with a seraph usually wind up bedridden for a time. So that's what happens to one who becomes a vessel. I don't feel so good. Hey, are you all right? Not really. I think I'll take a nap for about three days. Saray! Well now. Things are getting interesting. <laughs> uh, after you gain the powers of purification, you can obtain gall and equipment by purifying loot dropped by enemies of its malevolence. Equipped items may come with various skills attached. Try to collect different items by challenging a variety of enemies. Neat. Yes, please, it's the perfect time to save. Because I think this is a perfect time to end this episode. Hope everybody enjoyed.
please don't forget to uh, like, leave a comment down below, and subscribe. Till the next episode, take care.